pretty much my whole family, except for me and my little brother, are from West Africa, a place called Ghana. My grandfather on my mom's side was the president, actually, head of state. He was overthrown by a coup. They, they came in, they took him to a shooting range and executed him. My dad, being in the military at that time, thought it was best that they would flee the country. And unfortunately, I think when I'm going into the, the sixth grade, I want to say that some of my parents got divorced and uh, my dad moved back to Africa. Uh, you know, that's when things kind of got rough. You know, my mom have, having to work two jobs. You know, my friends are going places, doing things. They asking me to come along, and I'm asking my mom, you know, mom, I need money to go do this, go do that. You know, and she just, baby, I don't have it for you. I, I think it took me a while to realize that, you know, my mom really doesn't have it, and she's working hard to, you know, for just for, to put food on the table for me and my two brothers. By the grace of God and hard work, my brother got a scholarship. I got a scholarship, so that helped out my mom with tuition, you know, not having to pay for college. You know, once I got to college and knowing what my mom had been through, I knew that's when I wanted to be a, football, a professional football player, not only for just my mom, but for myself as well. But I mean, at that moment, that one summer that I was asking for, for all this money and she didn't have to give, I think right then that's when I knew I wanted it more.